OpenKM has an import station that allows automate the repository importation procedure. We run the application. We see here several files, a metadata file and a file that we want to import. Here we see the structure of the metadata, each column and the values separated below. We have in this case a metadata file for each file. And now we will connect to the importation station. We add a new task. In this case, we will import simple files, where each file has its own metadata file. Here we have the location where we will capture these files. And after, in the administration panel, we can see the metadata structure. We have to find here a metadata structure that match with the metadata that we want to import along with the files. We establish here the characteristics of the CSV file. And now we will add here the metadata fields. Here we will take the first metadata field. And here the pattern. In this case, it's a date metadata. We see here the format and the time format. We set the hours and minutes. And we continue with the rest of metadata that we want to import. This metadata match with the CSV structure with the definition that we have seen before. Here we already have all the metadata set it. We create a task. We can plan the task. In this case, we have created without planner. And we run it. We refresh the data. We see that it has finished and we see the results. We see the date and the hour when the task has been executed, and here we see the two files that have been imported and the task status. We see here that the files that we had before have gone, and now that they will appear inside OpenKM. We refresh, and here we see the files with metadata imported. Now we are going to do the same for other case that will be a file with metadata tied to several files within the same metadata file. We will see this metadata file that is the multiple. And here inside the CSV file we have several reference documents. We will create a new task. In this case, we will use the multiple procedure. This drop-down list that we see here can be extended easily thanks to the plugin system. Here we see that for the multiple case, we need to use the file name in the first column. We set the folder where there are the files in our PC and the final location. We continue with the metadata. Here we copy the metadata fields that we have in the CSV file. And finally, we create a task. 
Once created, we execute it. We refresh and we see the result. We see that it has finished correctly and here we can see the detail of the files that have been processed. We go to the appropriate folder. We see that the files are here and within its matching metadata. In the event of error, now we will force the creation of an error, we will see that this activity lag will enable us to identify what error has happened in which document and the reason because it has happened. Now we will execute it. We see that an error has happened. We see the execution. And here we can see the error cause. This let us manage large data importation volumes in different formats and in different configurations. The system is extensible and we can have the control of the whole process of transfer of documents through OpenKM. We can also create reports. For more information, don't hesitate to contact us via openkm.com, Facebook or Twitter.